What's going on you guys, Andrew Roboto here, and welcome back to Five Nights at Darl's 3, where we'll be continuing on with Night 2 and Part 2 of this Let's Play. And before I get started, I got a tip from a fellow YouTuber, and he told me that, um, in order to beat every night, we have to run to the bathroom and stay there, because the animatronics cannot kill you there. But anyways, without further ado, we'll continue with Night 2 and see what has to offer for us. Okay, so... Okay, why the bathroom? Why do we have to hide in the bathroom? That's my question. Oh, here's the bathroom. Okay, so we're in the bathroom. We can open the cabinet and grab a battery. Okay. Okay, so we just have to stay in the bathroom for the rest of the night to avoid being jump scared. Alright, well that makes sense. I guess the animatronics don't want to come in the bathroom because they don't want to violate your privacy. <laughs> I guess they don't want to. And plus, not to mention, a bathroom. Plus, my other question, my question is, like, why do we have to hide in the bathroom just to avoid the characters being jump scared? They could, they could hear you going to the bathroom because you're making noise when you're going to the bathroom and washing your hands and whatnot. But I mean, I guess you gotta hide there. And plus, the good thing is these nights go by fast because we have a timer right there. Yeah, we're in a bathroom, it looks like it. <sighs> oh, okay. Okay, so apparently, um, Sack Prize comes out of the bathtub, and we just have to flash our light at him to keep him away from us. Okay. I was trying to figure out who was in the bathtub. I was trying to figure out how to deal with sack prize because his, his bar, the exposure bar, kept going down. And I was trying to figure out where he was coming from, but he's coming from the bath the bathtub. Okay, so he's got to stay in the bathroom and then and then use the flashlight to scare off Sack Prize. And then, as for Darl, Darl, and Gina, they can't kill you in the bathroom. Most likely because they don't want to violate your privacy. While Sack Prize wants to violate our privacy by coming out of the bathtub and killing us. <laughs> Besides, the bathroom's kind of a weird place to hide in in this game. I mean, it makes sense in Five Nights of Warriors 2, same with, um... Five Nights of Warriors trapped within and a bunch of other Five Nights of Warriors fan games. But in this game, it kind of doesn't make sense. The good thing is we can use the bathroom in this game. I don't know. Apparently you can use the bathroom in this game, but you got to keep your flashlight on with you because Sack Prize will come out of the bathtub. Okay, so his exposure bar is good, so we don't have to flash our light at him. Until it like starts to go down. And plus we have a sound cue which is footsteps. Does he come from anywhere else in the bathroom or no? It's just okay, it's just about. And we have a cabinet right there to grab a battery. Which speaking of, I gotta grab a battery because the battery's running low. We only have two batteries, so we have to conserve it, but I'm not really going to use it that much. I'm only going to use it to check on sack price, so we should be good to go. And then we'll be able to take on a knife. Or, I don't know. And I'm going to be able to take on night three in this video as well, since we got enough time to. Or, or you know what, actually, I take that back. I'm going to take on night three in, the, in another video with night four. Because this is part two, so I'm just going to keep it at night two. 
So we'll do night three for another video. Anyways, though. Alright, there we have it. We beat Night 2 in Part 2 of this video. Perfect. And do we have a cutscene? Oh, we have a cutscene. If, if only you could understand the pain we feel. Oh, and it just shows, and it just shows Darl crying. Darl's crying blood, apparently. Okay, and it just jumps into night three, which we will take on night three in the next video. Thank you for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button. Also, comment and subscribe. I appreciate all the support you've given me. Hit the bell to receive all notifications of upcoming videos on my channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.